Science 8, Week 3, here's what you got to do. Uh, the assignment is called Forces and Motion Review Wrap-Up. Click on it. Okay. It is a Microsoft form. Okay. And Mrs. Wickman reminds you, use whatever resources you want from uh, your motion, motion and Forces unit to help you. Um, so you click on the forms. Okay. It's going to open up here. Um, step one, write your name here just as a safeguard in case uh, it wasn't tying these form results to your name. Uh, we'll be able to identify, Miss Wickman will be able to figure out whose answers are, are whose. Um, so it's real easy. You just look at each question, read each question, and choose the right answer. Now the only weird thing is the answer choices are not in order. It should say one, two, three, four. You got to make sure you're clicking. If the answer is four, which I don't know if answer four is correct, you make sure you click the bubble next to four, even though it's in the wrong order. For some reason, the answers are in a random order in each question. Mrs. Wickman and I worked on it today, and we couldn't figure out how to fix it. So you're just going to have to make do Make sure that after you read the question, you find where that number is underneath it and click the correct bubble. Um, there's 31 questions. There's actually 30 questions because the first question is, what is your name? And at the end, if you want, you can select this little button right here and it will email you a receipt of all of your responses. If you don't want that, you can leave it unchecked and then just click this submit button at the bottom. Uh, and that's all you got to do. Once you click that submit button, you can click close and there's no turn in button because it's a form. So once you click submit, your answers are sent to uh, Mrs. Wickman. That's all you got to do for science.